It started as a project that was just for the kids, but the end result is so brilliant that Clarendon School wanted everyone to see it. And special schools are, are unknown to so many people uh, and we wanted to really celebrate what our children can do rather than just focusing on the things they find difficult. Nick Raggett made the film and his son Max is at the school. He plays the spaceman. Excuse me, but I think I want to go to the moon. What sort of things did you have to do? Can you tell me? Uh, active. Yeah. <laughs> You can have a plan with these things, can't you? But that's not often how it turns out in the no, end, is and the, it? and the magic moments um, came from just having the camera on and suddenly the, the, the kids would say something, which was wonderful. He has a point. This is what happened when I got a dancing lesson from Max. Is that right? <laughs> My flosses are rubbish? What, do I, what am I doing wrong? Yeah, all right, Max, I get the idea. I can't go as fast as you. One of the film's main aims is to reassure parents who are considering taking their kids out of mainstream education to send them to a special school. It's an amazing school and people should come. Yeah. yeah. And brilliant school. Did you like making the film? Yeah. You liked it? Yeah. You liked the film? Yeah. In fact, they're so proud of it, they asked to watch it every afternoon. We How many times do you think you've watched it? About seven times. About seven times? Yeah. Since the film was posted online, it's been watched thousands of times. So how does Nick feel about the reaction? Yeah, it really gets me. Um, um, and it, it shows that you do need a film like this. Because um, I hope it's uplifting. It's not tears of sadness. It's, it's, it's hopefully an uplifting feeling. So, yeah. It absolutely is. We have mountains to climb. Not least because you get the feeling that for these kids in this school, not even the sky is the limit. I don't mean to be rude, but I still want to go to the moon. And why not, Max? Ruth Lipchot, 5 News.